Second chapter. Lesson number 12. The various elements of your show, the adjustment menu. Part 4. In this fourth part, we will see the last command's adjustment menu. They are in order. The chroma key control, functions, colorize, shadows, and outline. Start with the chroma key command. Open the slide editor and add a layer of type image. See the effects and trimmings this command. But first, what is this editor? Chroma key command to define and apply the transparency of a selected color to your layer. Yes, as said, this is akin gibberish. See this with an example. We have our photo layer type or another, and, in this case, I would remove the purple background, so that it becomes transparent. It is possible, in this case, provided that the rest of the image does not contain the same color as we will remove because, otherwise, all parts of the image that contain the color, also become transparent. Click the button chroma key to open the editing window. In superior part of the editor, you have the preview window. You will notice that it is black, and not with the traditional checkered transparency. The lower part consists of controls for trimming the choice of color to make transparent. You should also know that this editor gives the chosen color, full transparency, and you cannot change its opacity, for, against, it is possible to degrade transparency. We will not explain all the technical calculation by the program, but in view only mode. First, you have the definition of the desired base color, this is the command, key color. You the preview of the selected color in a small rectangle just to the right of the name, as for almost any color controls, and it is followed by the command button, set, which opens the editor color. The default define color is black. Click the set command to open the color editor. In our case, as we have seen previously, we will use the eyedropper tool to select the base color to remove. Click the eyedropper icon and, in the preview window, make a click with your pipette, the average color to remove. In this example, we have a sly gradient moth, click on the middle purple of this gradient. Once the right color selected, click, set color to selected and close the editor. We just below, two groups of two commands each. The first group plays on the extent chromatic color to remove, and the second, on the level intensity that color. The first group plays on the command hue, which defines the extent of the color change, or, in other words, from 0 to 100% of color containing a defined color. If we select the pure blue, at 0%, only the pure blue will be deleted, and at 100%, all containers color blue in its composition. Here, always the shades are fully removed, and will be completely transparent. Is the hue threshold command to define the color range. It is followed by the command, hue drop off, which it allows you to soften the removal of color as a transparency gradient. Warning, the gradient is always done after the scope of the threshold control, and only up to the maximum scope thereof. If you set the drop off at 100%, the endpoint is always the same, and therefore, if your threshold is 10%, its scope will be 90% and at 100%, practically zero. Is two orders only play on the variety of colors to a brightness level equal? Also, the following two control intensity, it plays on the scope of brightness difference with respect to the base color. As for the color, they are composed of commands, threshold, allowing you to define the reach of the total suppression, and control, drop off, allowing you to soften up minimum and maximum brightness, it is it, black and white. 
It is two control unit works together, which mean that the difference in intensity chosen will focus on the full color range selected. To obtain the desired result, it is sometimes necessary to make many different trimmings. Here are the settings required to get the desired result in our image. This method is useful if you have an item removed from an almost united color. There stay in order in this editor, the command, color suppression, which is totally independent of the first four. It removes the portion of the selected color in the chromatic range and intensity, from 0% to 100% range. Take, for example, pure blue value in the key color command, then delete it from 0 to 100% with the color suppression order to see its effect. As for all the controls in this group, when you close the editor using the command, done, the effect is applied to your layer and its checkbox is now checked. As said earlier, if you select this command without first having to perform trimmings, this is the default option will be applied. Or the deletion of only pure black. Un this controller and see the following command, function, colorize. This command allows you to replace all the colors of your layer by a specific color, which intensity is equal to that of the replaced color. When you select this command by clicking its checkbox, knowing the basic color set is medium gray, then it gives directly a black and white effect to your layer. You can select the replacement color by clicking on the command set, located directly to the right of the preview of the color used. Click this button, and in the color editor, select a color in shades of beige. Then the effect obtained is that of a black and white photo, yellowed by time. Just to the right of the color control, you have a trimming named, Strength, which allows you to set the pouch into replacement color chosen. Original, it is 100%. Open the cursor trimming by performing a click in the numerical box, and move the cursor to 70%. We now have the effect of a color photo yellowed by time. This command is also in the effect menu, and can be changed over time, while allowing you past an image in black and white to color, or change the colors to give it such an effect nightclub, under the effective change of color spots, using only a single layer. Unk the color eyes command and see the shadow command. It allows you to give a shadow effect by the image, and, as if the light came from the left supper rear corner. Click the checkbox for enabled. Original shadow is black, and the occurrence, on a black background, it does not show. Modify its color, and then define white. Now you can see the effect of this command. To his right, you have a control setting of the opacity of the shadow, of origin, it is set to 50%. Set it to 100%, with either the slider, or, by entering the value directly in the digital space. You will notice that now the shadow is much more pronounced. Un- this command and see the last of this menu, function, outline, which creates a border color and thickness defined by it. Of origin, the border is white, and a thickness of 1 pixel. As in the two preceding commands, you can set the border color using the button control, set, and its thickness by the trimming, size. The maximum thickness of the border is 5 pixels. Here is an example of a purple border on maximum thickness. Many of the commands in this menu are also found in the effect menu, and can be changed temporarily, but it is of preferable brought the most change possible in this editor, allowing you then the economics of using a mask or multiple layer to achieve the same effect, and thus gain memory and rendering speed. See an effect obtained only with this menu, requiring for its creation as a single layer. done, our second chapter ends.
In the next, we will see the different other elements that can be made to your show, as it's trimmings time, texts, and still another elements modified slide by slide. Thank you for your attention.